Hello and welcome to our seven-part video series on online reputation management, and today we're embarking on an enlightening journey into the digital landscape of your brand's reputation. Your online reputation, believe it or not, is a critical aspect of your business. And so understanding how to manage your reputation effectively can mean the difference between thriving in your niche or being overtaken by your competitors. Over the course of this series, we will guide you through the following list of critical topics. The first topic we'll explore is understanding the importance of online reputation management. And then we'll look at identifying and monitoring your online reputation followed by responding to negative reviews and feedback. The next topic explored will be building and promoting positive reviews, and then we'll get a handle on managing your brand's social media presence. The final two topics we'll be discussing are protecting your business from fake reviews and measuring the impact of your reputation management efforts. In this first video, we'll delve into the cornerstone of our journey understanding the importance of online reputation management and its impact on your business. With the advent of the internet, communication, and business has drastically evolved. Potential customers and clients can easily search for your business online and often form their perception of your brand based on what they find. This is why cultivating a robust online reputation is critical. It can literally make or break your business. A well-managed online reputation can bolster credibility, build trust, and boost your business. Conversely, a poor online reputation can result in lost customers, dwindling revenue, and damage to your brand. Therefore, keeping a pulse on your online reputation is not just beneficial, it's vital. Regular monitoring of comments, feedback, and suggestions can offer invaluable insights for business growth and improvement. And let's not forget, quick response to negative feedback can prevent minor issues from snowballing into major reputation crises. In our next video, we'll delve into the practical aspects, how to identify and monitor your online reputation. We'll explore different platforms and tools you can utilize to keep track of your brand's online presence and quickly respond to any negative feedback or reviews. So stay tuned and join us on this journey to empower your brand. Until next time, keep growing and keep shining. Subscribe to our channel and never miss out on any of our new series. Thanks for watching. You are currently at the end of part one. You may now pause the training and come back later. Or you may continue on to part two, which will begin shortly. Hello everyone! In the last video, we discussed the importance of online reputation management and how it can impact your business. Today, we're diving deeper into how to identify and monitor your online reputation effectively. One of the first steps in managing your online reputation is to identify where your brand is being mentioned online. This includes social media platforms, review sites, forums, and blogs. It's critical to regularly monitor these platforms to see what's being said about your brand, allowing you to respond swiftly to any negative feedback or reviews. Now, you might be wondering, how can I monitor all these platforms? Fortunately, there are several tools and platforms that can help you with this task. Firstly, Google Alerts. This service allows you to set up alerts for specific keywords so you'll be notified when your brand is mentioned online. Then there are social media management tools. Many of them, such as Hootsuite, Sprout Social, and Buffer, offer monitoring and analytics features that can help you keep track of your brand's social media presence. Lastly, we have review monitoring tools like Review Trackers, Reputation, and Yopo. These tools can help you stay on top of reviews across various platforms like Yelp, Google Reviews, and TripAdvisor. Once you've identified where your brand is being mentioned online, it's important to monitor these platforms regularly. This allows you to respond quickly to any negative feedback or reviews, while also giving you the opportunity to promote positive ones. In our next video, we'll be discussing how to respond to negative reviews and feedback We'll be covering the best practices for dealing with negative reviews and how to turn them into an opportunity to improve your business. You don't want to miss out on the next video in this series, so be sure to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and hit that notification bell to stay updated. Until then, keep an eye on your online reputation.
And remember, your brand's image is in your hands. You are currently at the end of part two. You may now pause the training and come back later, or you may continue on to part three, which will begin shortly. Hello, and welcome back to our series. In the last video, we discussed how to identify and monitor your online reputation. Today, we're gonna tackle something all businesses face, negative reviews and feedback. Remember, how you respond to these reviews can significantly sway your online reputation and consequently your business. So here are some best practices for handling these situations. Respond quickly. Show your customers that you're listening and you care. Be empathetic. Understand your customer's viewpoint and apologize for any inconvenience. Take responsibility. If the complaint is valid, own up to it and explain how you'll make it right. Offer a solution. This could mean compensation or another method to resolve the issue. And finally, always be professional. Stay away from defensive or argumentative reactions. Remember, not all negative reviews are bad. They can provide opportunities to enhance your business. Turn your customer's feedback into improvements that will positively impact your business. In the next video, we'll delve into building and promoting positive reviews. That's all for today. Until next time, remember, every piece of feedback is a step towards growth. Please like, share, and subscribe to help us produce more content like this. You are currently at the end of part three. You may now pause the training and come back later, or you may continue on to part four, which will begin shortly. Hello everyone. Welcome back to our series on online reputation management. In our last video, we discussed how to effectively respond to negative reviews and feedback. Today, we'll explore how to build and promote positive reviews, which significantly impact your online reputation and your business. They enhance credibility, foster trust, and ultimately generate more business. Here are some strategies and tactics you can use to encourage your happy customers to leave positive reviews. Ask for reviews. Don't hesitate to ask your satisfied customers to leave a review. You can ask them in person, via email, or on social media. Make it easy for them. Provide direct links to review sites or create an accessible spot for them to leave a review on your website. Show appreciation. Respond to and thank customers for their positive feedback and reviews. This not only encourages them, but also attracts more positive reviews. Use social proof. Feature positive reviews on your website, social media, and in your marketing materials to assure potential customers of your credibility. Promoting your positive reviews is an essential part of building a positive online reputation. Here are some ways you can do it effectively. Share them on social media. This gives potential customers a glimpse of what they can expect when they engage with your business. Use them in your marketing materials. Positive reviews make great additions to your brochures, website, and email campaigns. Responding to positive reviews publicly demonstrates your appreciation for your customers' feedback. Remember, building and promoting positive reviews is an ongoing process. So, stay alert for new reviews and keep encouraging satisfied customers to leave them. In our next video, we'll be discussing how to manage your brand's social media presence. We'll cover strategies and tactics for creating and maintaining a positive social media presence that will help build and protect your online reputation. Until next time, keep focusing on creating great customer experiences and the positive reviews will follow. Please like, share and subscribe to help us produce more content like this. You are currently at the end of part four. You may now pause the training and come back later, or you may continue on to part five which will begin shortly. Hello everyone, and welcome back to our channel. In our last video, we delved deep into the process of building and promoting positive reviews for your brand. If you missed that, don't forget to check it out after watching this one. Today, we're moving on to another important aspect of brand management, managing your brand's social media presence. 
Social media is a powerful platform for building and protecting your online reputation. With the right strategy, you can forge stronger connections with your customers, cultivate trust, and ultimately drive more business. Here are some strategies and tactics that you can apply. Develop a consistent brand voice and aesthetic across all your social media channels. Post updates regularly. Engage with your followers and respond to comments and messages promptly. Showcase content that reflects your brand's values and personality. Implement social media monitoring tools to track mentions of your brand and respond promptly to any negative feedback or reviews. Leverage social media advertising to reach a wider audience and drive more traffic to your website. Remember, social media isn't just a platform for broadcasting your message. It's a two-way street. Listen to your customers and followers, absorb their feedback, and use it to fine-tune your business approach. In the next video, we'll delve into how to protect your business from the potential harm of fake reviews. We'll cover strategies to detect and remove fake reviews and discuss prevention methods for the future. Until next time, keep engaging, stay consistent, and remember, your brand's voice matters. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more informative videos like this. You are currently at the end of part 5, you may now pause the training and come back later, or you may continue on to part 6, which will begin shortly. Welcome back. In our last video, we explored the ins and outs of managing your brand's social media presence. Today, we're diving into an equally crucial topic, protecting your business from fake reviews. Fake reviews can significantly harm your online reputation, credibility, and trust among customers. And ultimately, they can lead to lost customers and revenue. Today, we'll equip you with strategies and tactics to detect and remove fake reviews and prevent them from tarnishing your business reputation. Here's what we'll cover. Firstly, monitor your reviews. This means regularly checking all platforms for any suspicious or fake reviews. Secondly, use review monitoring tools. These tools can help you detect fake reviews and flag them for removal. Third, report fake reviews to the appropriate platform or website. They have mechanisms in place to remove these reviews. Next, respond professionally to any fake reviews. Provide evidence of the misleading reviews to the platform. This helps maintain your business's integrity. Then, encourage authentic reviews. Make it easy for satisfied customers to leave their feedback. And lastly, be proactive. Create a policy for handling fake reviews and have a plan in place to prevent them. Remember, protecting your business from fake reviews is not a one-time thing. It's an ongoing process. Keep an eye out for new fake reviews and take the necessary steps to remove them and prevent future occurrences. Until next time, stay vigilant and take charge of your online reputation. Remember, your credibility is your business's most valuable asset. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more valuable insights. I'll see you in the next video. You are currently at the end of part 6. You may now pause the training and come back later. Or you may continue on to part 7, the final video of this series, which will begin shortly. Hello everyone, and welcome back to our channel. In our last video, we discussed how to protect your business from fake reviews. Now, let's move on to the final episode of our series where we will be uncovering the tools and metrics you need to measure the impact of your reputation management efforts. Understanding the effectiveness of your strategies and tactics is vital in the realm of online reputation management. By monitoring the right indicators, you can track the progress you've made and also discover the areas that need your attention. Let's discuss some of the metrics and tools you can employ to track your progress and gauge the impact of your reputation management efforts. Firstly, review metrics. Keep track of the number of reviews you receive, their average rating, and the sentiment behind them. There are several review monitoring tools available to help you with this. Secondly, social media metrics. Monitor your social media engagement, follower growth, and the sentiment of comments and mentions you receive. Thirdly, website analytics. 
keep an eye on the traffic coming to your website, the bounce rate, and the average time spent by visitors on your site. Google Analytics is a highly recommended tool for this purpose. Fourthly, customer satisfaction surveys. These can be an invaluable resource to measure customer satisfaction and identify areas that require improvement. Finally, keep an eye on your sales and revenue. Look for correlations between these figures and your reputation management efforts. By regularly monitoring and analyzing these metrics, you can gain powerful insights into how well your reputation management efforts are working and make decisions based on actual data to improve your online reputation. We hope this video series has been helpful in your journey to understand the importance of online reputation management and in implementing effective strategies. To your success and see you in our next video series. Remember to like, share, and subscribe to help us produce more content like this. Thanks for watching. This video series was brought to you by BCB Canada, a viewer powered channel. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe. Your subscription will enable us to continue making free, valuable content.